Nine days ago, I opened my comment section and someone has written to me that whether I'm teaching long form content or short form content, I'm always fast. She says, always. Okay, that made me think and recalculate and see how can I change the way that I teach you because I always want you with me. Let's redo this video together with animation for free on Canva. First, I want to show you the end product, how it's going to look like when we are done. Let's just have a look. Go swing and move your feet. with a beautiful song that I could create with Suno or any software so you can use any software to create your music and as you see on the screen some of these you can use for free and you can go ahead and create a beautiful song so I'm gonna get chat GPT to create the full lyrics for me without emojis so that I can copy it to Suno you want to learn how to create music with Suno Please go find this video because I've created it for you so that you can learn. It's about six minutes long and you can learn how to create music with Suno. So once you've created your music and you've downloaded your music, there are different characters that you could pick to use on your video music for your kids. So I did ask ChatGPT to give me different characters and I can use school items. I can use nature's creatures. I can use elements. I decided to run with the cultural items and use music. But you could go to ChatGPT and ask for different because we've seen a lot of veggies and we've seen a lot of fruits, but it doesn't mean you, don't, you can't do those. You can do whatever you want. It's just that there's more that you could do. I've asked for alternatives which are not fruit or veggies. So what next now you're gonna go to your canva and create your characters remember this is a free account so we need to be clever about this and create our character in a free way so we're gonna use the video landscape option for our youtube because it is the one that i want to use for my channel but if you are on tiktok you can use your tiktok the 9 by 16 the vertical format once you've created your canvas the first step you would love to create your hands and your legs for the character that we want to use. So if you go to your elements and you search for cartoon legs, for example, these cartoon legs, I've scrolled through thousands of these. All of them are paid. And I promised you on this video that we're going to create free ones that you can use so we want something like that and the leg pointing that direction and if you're on canva these kinds of graphics you have to pay for and we're going for free so what i then decided to do was to use my magic media for free and then go to graphics on magic media and then create the legs and the arms and the create them myself so i got chat gpt to be involved with this creation and he gave me a prompt that I'm going to add for you in the description below and you can ask ChatGPT to create them separately or all together so but I wanted to show you that the option is there when you paste it like this you need to take out the copyright from Disney because it's gonna say no it's not according to our terms and conditions so we delete the Mickey Mouse and we just write illustrated gloves. So what is important here, it creates a 2D illustration, vector style, flat color for mm -hmm. drag and drop editing with kids friendly. So make sure that that part is included in your description somewhere so that you can get the vector images that we want. Cool, and then I'm choosing the monoline style to create this and I'm going to go and create the graphic. These I like, these look like something we can use and I would do the same for legs. 
that is just perfection or oh, our music video that we're creating has a guitar as well as drum trumpet and a piano so we're going to create these characters using canva and we're going to put these on the side so that we can create our character and we're going to go to our elements and we're searching for piano let's start with piano because it's easier and then we type piano on our elements and we go to graphics and we're looking for free piano so there are no options to select free that means you're just going to scroll down until you find a piano that you could use that's free like this one you click and you add it once this is a free one and then you make it big and you crop it like so and then you go back to your elements and you look for cartoon face that is also free i did find a cartoon face that was free it was this one and it's called happy cute kawaii face you just click on it once and you add it to your design and you just make the eyes black okie dokie so now we have a face we're gonna adjust it on our little piano man and we've duplicated the arms so that we have a left arm and we have a right arm and then we go and add it to our little guy so that they have little arms and it's very important to take note that with the tool that we're going to use to animate this guy both of the legs need to be pointing the other direction so they need you need to crop out this leg and duplicate this so that it is standing and pointing the same direction otherwise your guy is going to look weird and you will see when we animate him that we need for him to be pointing that direction so i'm going to just delete that and duplicate this And then you have your little man. okay we have mr trumpet mr guitar and mrs drum and mr piano guy so what you then do you are going to download these as images and then you're going to make them move and animate so we'll select the first one and we're going to click on share and we click on download and we want to download it as a png and then we want to download it separately so that we can go and animate it great stuff next you're going to open another tab and you're going to search for sketchmetamolab.com i've used this website before you can check it out on one of my videos with this animation this helps you animate characters that even your kids have drawn this is the one that's going to help us animate we're going to select upload a photo and then we go pick one of our guys up and then have the two add them on here and once they are in we click on next it will scan it for us then you're going to make sure that the whole image is in the scan so that we're able the character is just fitting in there everything is covered 
as it shows you on the checklist, you're going to resize it. Then you click next. And then if some of the character doesn't show, like the eyes are not showing, then you're going to match it and make sure that everything shows. So I'm going to pick not the eraser, the pencil, and just make sure that even her face or his face shows on our so that everything is highlighted as you see where it asks you to either erase or fix the body parts that don't show. So then click on erase and erase the extra white space underneath the arms. Otherwise it's going to be tangled and become one thing. Now it is done. We are able to pick and choose an animation that we would like to download. So this area that you see here, you can click and have the tool animate for you and then you can download it. So it could be dancing, it could be fighting, it could be walking. You can choose whichever one you want and then you can download different kinds of animation. Cool, right? That's so cool. And then if you want to download them now, you're going to click on this full screen view and then you're going to select the three dots and you're going to download them. Once you're done, you're going to escape and do another one and download that so depending on how many you want you can just have as many as you want for your video but you're gonna be making music for the kids now that we've downloaded all of our videos it is time now for us to put everything together you can use Canva you can use CapCut whichever one works for you that's perfectly fine I think I want to use Canva. So I'm going to hide these images or these pages and then I don't want to delete them because I want to use them. Maybe I might use them. So I'll just hide all of them and then start uploading the music and then start creating the video with my Canva. Okay, so I'm going to go to my uploads and I'm going to click on upload file and then upload all of these videos as well as the music and then I can start creating. The main purpose of this video was to show you how to animate these kitties animated fun characters if they are not fruits or if they are not pumpkin and vegetables you can use other sources to make these videos that can generate income for you online you can go ahead and use all of your skills that you have to use ai and edit and make it quite fun so that it's enjoyable for the kids putting it all together took me like a long while if I create that video you must let me know if you want me to let me know in the comments if you want me to show you how I made them dance like that on a video and add colorful that's the Canva tools that we have on Canva and the Canva apps that help me put this one together if you enjoy content like this please share it so that we can have as many people we can help with this kind of content Thank you so much for joining me today. I will see you with our next video.